And my name is Walter Roos. Moved here to uh, to Canada a number of years ago. Have a, a wife and five children. Um, joined the fire hall 15 years ago, and just recently became a uh, Canadian citizen. It was quite unique. I got the invitation to uh, to be part of the uh, swearing of the oath ceremony. Um, then we got the call to go to West Kelowna. I uh, ended up talking in the morning to our task force leader. So he gave me a location that was as close to the city as possible so that we'd have cell, uh, cell service. So I was sitting in the back of the truck and I had an iPad that I'd installed Zoom on. As I was doing the, uh, and following the, the presentation and the, the, the ceremony, my fellow firefighters, they peeked through the window a bunch of times there to kind of see what was going on. We're in the middle of where, where, the, where the fire had been and was still going on. I think it's, it's somewhat surreal. I didn't expect it to happen this way. I didn't expect it to work this way. I would say almost uh, exciting when it, when it ended up working out and everything went well. Ah, that's fantastic. Walter uh, was uh, in the interview was saying that, look, he didn't want his story to distract from the work that his colleagues, those incredible firefighters, uh, are doing and we're doing together. But it's okay, Walter, for Canadians to celebrate another great Canadian. Thank you for what you're doing.